Something to consider when recapping audio gear is why do we recap audio gear and when do we recap audio gear? We recap audio gear because capacitors are one of the few components in this whole system that has a lifespan that will end. And the reason that it will end is because capacitors are filled with an electrolyte fluid, kind of like a battery, kind of like battery acid, that holds that charge. And as good as manufacturing techniques can be, those capacitors can and will eventually dry up and the value will change. And you, you can only have so much mm, variation in, in your tolerances before you start to have problems with the audio as your caps dry up. Uh, this can lead to phase issues. It can lead to especially low frequency response issues. Um, and so as for the when, it's pretty common practice that if a piece of gear is 20 years old, then you consider it due for a recap, <clears throat> especially on the power supply. The power supply has the largest capacitors that work the hardest as they store that initial charge from the wall uh, and create reservoirs for the power that the rest of the circuit will need. So recapping your power supply is the priority about every 20 years and the smaller electrolytics, you might be able to get away with a little longer than that, but I think 20 years is just kind of when you do it. And then you have peace of mind and you know that you can use your gear for 20 more years and get the results that you would expect from a piece of equipment that was brand new from the factory. And uh, when it comes to recording, you need all the help you can get. You need to not be fighting any uphill battles with your gear. You need to have your gear making your sound better and helping your workflow. Gear should never get in the way of your process, get in the way of your music sounding the way you want it to. I happen to think that these compressors sound awesome. One of the things that I love about them is that there's only three knobs uh, and uh, really great metering. But again, they respond the way I expect a compressor to respond, and they sound the way I would want compressed audio to sound. Because sometimes compression, it just sounds like compression and it doesn't sound good. But a great compressor makes good sounding compression, great sounding compression. So we uh, digressed to talking about compressors rather than just recapping and uh, gear maintenance, but hopefully that was an interesting and helpful tidbit for you. XFO Audio.